thoughts on dopamine fasting. Thoughts on dopamine fasting. Well, dopamine fasting is the ultimate way to clear your head. So if you need to clear your head, if, you, if, you're, if you're feeling stuck, if you're feeling stagnant, if you're feeling unclear on something, dopamine fasting is by far the fastest way to get unstuck and to get, to get clear. It's just the fastest way. You have zero input. It's all output. It's just you for however many hours or however many days, just you in your notebook. That's all it is. So for those of you who don't know what dopamine fast is, it's when you go extended period of time without any food, without any internet, without any music, without any friends, without any interaction with anyone. You're by yourself just meditating. You're going for some walks and drinking water and writing in a book. That's it. So I'm doing a seven-day dopamine fast coming up. I'm going to be going from December 26th to January 1st. And I'm just going to be taking pen to paper, letting whatever come up come up. And in the past, whenever I've done a dopamine fast, that's how I got totally clear. That's how I pulled myself out of debt. I got out of I, I cleared thirty thousand dollars of debt within two months by doing a seven day dopamine fast. Because when I did a seven day dopamine fast, I learned what I needed to do to get out of debt. It just came to me. It was super clear. It was super obvious. And it wouldn't have come to me like that that quickly and that clearly and that obviously if I hadn't done the dopamine fast. I probably would still be in debt right now to this day had I not done that. And anytime I've done dopamine fast since then, I've always come up with really good ideas on how I can completely change my life for the better. So I'm excited to see what comes from this one. I'm a huge fan. I think dopamine fast should be done periodically throughout the year, at least once a year, if not twice a year, if not four times a year, every quarter. But I'm a huge fan of dopamine fasting and I highly recommend everyone do them. The cool thing about dopamine fasting is that you get so bored, like there's nothing to do. There's nothing to do. You can freaking walk around your house. You can stare at a wall. You can have a shower. You can drink some water. You can do some breath work. You can meditate. But you just get so freaking bored that your only real source of excitement, and humans are addicted to dopamine. We're addicted to excitement. We just love those hits of like new information. And if you're not reading books for information, the only place you're going to be getting new information is from within you. And so you start coming up with these ideas and the, the ideas are your, like, the only form of excitement. And so you become very sensitive to like really good ideas because you're so desperate for excitement. You're so like your dopamine receptors are like hunting for, for stimulation and because you're not getting it from the outside. You got to make it up yourself. And when you make it up yourself, you realize what a genius you are. You realize how much fun you can really have with your imagination and how much fun you can really have with, with your life if you just choose to have that kind of fun. But so many of us, we live vicariously through others way too much on social media that we're like, oh, wow, so-and-so's in Bali or so-and-so's in New York or so-and-so's making a million dollars. And when you live vicariously through people like that all the time, you don't feel like you need to do it at all. You're like, oh, I'm good. I'll just watch so-and-so make money instead. Meanwhile, you're broke. So... Rather than living vicariously to people who are making money, just learn how they're making money and then go do it yourself. Rather than living vicariously to people who are actually healthy and you're not healthy yourself, learn how to get healthy and do it yourself. Like it's all right to have role models. It's all right to have mentors. But if you just only scroll on social media and watch what they do all day and you don't do anything yourself, you're going to stay broke. You're going to stay unhealthy. You're going to stay unhappy. So by, by stopping the input and just getting everything out on paper, you realize like, wow, I know so much and I'm going to do so much. I got so many cool ideas. And like I said, you become really sensitive to good ideas on dopamine fasts. And uh, you're so bored that you want nothing else but to execute on these ideas. You're like, this is the idea. That's what I'm going to do. And, and what was like previously super hard or super scary now becomes like your only way out of this boredom hell <laughs> that you've put yourself in. So you're like, you like value, make a promise to yourself. You're like when I get out of this dopamine fast, I'm going to run this business. I'm going to launch this thing. I'm going to install this new habit into my life. And uh, they're profoundly life-changing for sure. Profoundly life-changing. 